what's left of the cage. I'm doing things my way now. Yeah. Man, I'm willing to die for the cause. That's the difference between me and y'all. To be the best, you have to beat the best. I'm undefeated. My style is everlasting. And I'ma never back down, you fucking clown. The world is mine. WBC title, John Jarvis, my old friend from many years ago for the Lumpini Crawley, said this girl, Lubena Jane Itzka, is very good. And another good friend of mine from Wales, Lee Powers, with Becky Hodge. This is going to be very, very exciting. Becky Hodge is more interested in listening than me. <laughs> well, five round contest for the WBC title. Stepping in for this fight, Becky Hodge, very brave against a very, very strong. Jay Nice, who I have commentated on before, and is very, very strong. Yeah, she is. Very thick set legs. Look at the muscle in them for them. Only 22 years of age, and yeah. I know that John Jarvis trains him extremely hard. So does Lee. And trains with Ruth Ash down the court. A very, very good female fighter. Yeah, Ruth, a few times world champion. Oh, nice. Utilising her height, Becky Hodge. Really getting to her now, Jane. It's really trying her best. She can be very aggressive, Billy. She is a very aggressive girl, yeah, she is. Oh, closing that gap down. The Bella Jane Ice just stepping through and Becky Hodge needs to keep her away because when she gets on the inside, she is very, very aggressive. I like the way... Um, this is a, this is a, she's took this fight on late notice, yep. Hodge, you know, she really has. There's power so you've got to give her credit for the injured Vicky Church. Yep, yep. Yeah, never easy stepping in, but no. sometimes coming with nothing to lose, Vinny. No, not at all. He's utilising the height very well in the opening of this fight. She's bullying him already, Jane, isn't she? Yep. I like the way she kicks first and follows very fast with her hands. Yeah. Good Tidy. round. Yep, untidy start from the Bella Jane Ice for her. She usually I see her a lot more relaxed. Yeah, a very, very interesting round indeed. We're just going to bring in Andrew King Cobra Tate, the newly crowned 90 kilo infusion world champion, also double a uh, ISKA. He's a four time world champion. He is indeed. Andrew, I just want to ask you, Smash Muay Thai doing a really good job at the moment, aren't you? The show's fantastic, isn't it? The show is fantastic. I'm really enjoying it. Every single fight's been an absolute war, and that's what you want to see, so... There's a purpose, Andrew, isn't there, behind you coming here, obviously, to see the show, but there's one thing that's on your mind. You want that WBC title, don't you? I absolutely do, and I, I want absolutely every title out there. And then I found out who held this title, which is Marlon Hunt. And I think that Marlon Hunt's a phony. I think he has far too many titles that he doesn't deserve. I think he chooses his opponents. He changes rules last minute. And I've thought it for a very long time. And when I finally took the guy on, when I finally got on the ring with him, Vinny, I took it on 
I was fighting training maybe twice a week. I was on antibiotics, I couldn't train properly, and I still beat him up. So I want to fight him again and take every belt off. Well, there you go, then Andrew Tate calling out Marlin Hunt. Thank you, Andrew. Another world title in the fans Straight of the Straight in with the action here. The Bella J. Nice from the Crawley Lumpini camp. With the very handsome and accomplished John Jarvis in her corner. And I think he's fired her up for this round. Yeah, he has. And I mean, she's an aggressive kid anyway. She's only 22 years of age. Um, so she means business. Loves that kick and following with the uh, hand after. Quite impressive, Becky, though. I thought this fight was going to be harder for her than what it is at the moment, I'll be honest. She's putting a good testament to the uh, Welsh gym here. Yeah, she's starting to use, trying to use a range, uh, Hodge. Seems strong in the clinch as well, Hodge. Trying to lock on, I think, Jane, it'd be better to grab the back instead of trying to reach for the neck. Most definitely, yep. Keep getting tuck her headed into the chest and starts using the swing knee. Yeah, yet again. Yeah, it's a bit down. It, Annoying that, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, well. Lee Power caught that amulet in his Good mouth. Good right there. hand from Becky Hodge. Starting to push Jane back now. Yeah, Becky's growing in this fight. She is. But she needs to watch that hand over the top from Jane. This, the best I've seen from Becky Hodge. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's really going for it, though. It's a little workhorse, isn't she? Uh, I think she's struggling with the, she's struggling with the distance here, Vinny. Yeah, she is. It's so hot in there, though, isn't it, as well? Really is, yeah. The Bella needs to be more patient for me. Yeah, Miss Ice needs to be more patient, wait for the shot, avoid it, and then close the distance. Good round for Hodge, this, isn't it? Yeah, Becky Hodge's round so far. So far, yeah. End of the round two, and that's in the, that's in the history books. <laughs> so, as we're going to round three of this WBC national title, the beautiful golden and green belt right next to me and Danny well, one of these girls is going home with it yep and Lebena Jane Ice really from the Lumpini Crawley wearing that now knows she's in a fight and I'll tell you what Becky Hodge before the fight I had as an underdog coming in here and he's real laying it down now she's scoring bigger with the knees good catching a kickback from Jane when you're tall in these weight characters, you have to utilise that advantage, don't you? Lee Power calling out, use the long knee as she walks forward. Yeah, and the teeth works very well. Yeah, it's good advice, isn't it? Yeah, of course, Lee knows what he's doing, so does John, good coaches. Good scoring kicks from Podge. Nice kick back from yep. Jane. Doesn't like stepping backwards, does she? No. Step in! Step in! Uh, does follow the hand very well after she's kicked, you know. She does. Good trick, that. She doesn't go back in straight lines either. She moves Good right circles. hand from yeah. Hodge. Got caught, didn't she? Yeah. Jane scoring more in this round, she's doing more, that's all. Starting to accomplish herself in this fight yeah, now. Nice knee, but she slipped. Yeah, I think push. the punch helped her on her way, though. Yeah, it did. Starting to grow into her game now, the Lumpini girl. Nice smile from Becky Hodge, but none of that from Jane. No, I think... None of that shenanigans going on here, let me tell you.
The soldiers are out on the battlefield as we go into round number four. First out, Lubena Jane Ice from the Lumpini Crawley. Needs to get busy now. Slip, no mercy. Kick to the head as she goes down, legal. Good hands. Getting told not to wait is Becky Hodge. Yeah. B first. She catches the leg well, doesn't she, and kicks back, Jane. Yeah. Scores well. Becky did take this on short notice, but taking nothing away from any any skill or, or any whoever wins this. Good right, right hand starting again, to catch yeah. Jane on a regular basis. Jane's struggling here, isn't she? Yeah. Those big, long knees from Becky. Doing damage to the very muscular frame of the better Jane Ice. Look at the muscle in those calf muscles, Billy. Yeah, she looks tired though now, Hodge. Yeah, opening up wide for air, isn't she? Yeah, she is. Very hot in this arena. It'd be a good rematch, this, you know. It'd be a good rematch. Yep. Because For what reasons, Vinny? Um, because of Hodges took it on short notice. Yeah. And it's not taking nothing away from Jane at all in the slightest. She's only beating who she can put in front of at the moment. I think she is winning. In honesty, I've seen Jane fight better than this. Uh, it's, it's a big stage, or isn't it? Not, that it's, not, that, not that it's not a great performance right here, right now. She had a change of opponent, so it must play with your mind, it must play with your head. The hands are low. Yeah. Push kick, followed through. Wearily goes back to a corner then as he walks back on wobbly legs as the Welsh girl just nearly collapsed in her body language, says it all as she's gone through the arduous task of battling the lady just across the ring from her, the Crawley sensation, Jane Isco. Tell you something, ladies and gentlemen, you're going to have to muster up some more action because coming up very soon is Smash 10 in Liverpool. Me and Danny Kendrick will be bringing you an absolute scorching card for two WBC world titles. Andy Housen against a Frenchman whose name escapes me and Liam the Hitman Harrison, the number one contender versus Medis Toots, the WBC champion. That's going to be really exciting coming to you from Liverpool. The Olympia tickets are available September the 6th. So, we've got Jane slightly ahead in this one. Yeah, I think Jane just may be a point ahead, but she has definitely, definitely struggled with the height and the tenacity of Becky Hodge from the Eagles gym. And Becky could steal this fight for me if she has a massive round now. She needs a really big round though, mate. Yep. He's coming up to He's the head. He's to the head really high. When you're the taller fighter, Vinny, that's what you've got to yeah. do, haven't you? I've never been taller than anyone, my friend. You know? But you are good in a good knees up. <laughs> yeah, thanks. Vertically challenged, as they say. But yeah, I mean, I'm impressed with both these skill, the girls' skills. Real good heart show, good body kick good, there. Yeah. That was a good score, that was. I think this, this fight will be closer than we all think, actually. But the quality hand shots have come from the Bella Jane Ice. She's got some yeah, very strong ca punches. Catching kickback, James. Yeah, good. more effective. Good. Good. She's taking a lot of right hands, Jane. Much improved Becky Hodge here for me. So, yeah, she's very good, yeah. She's done really well. It's all about who wants it most now. Yep. It's... Becky's tired. She's fighting with her heart now. There she is. James still coming forward. Oh, 
all the time, pressing. She's not took a back step as she changed. No. Hands look low, though, against the tall opponent. Eyes wide, the pretty face of the Crawley star. Yep. I think she's Still just stolen this. Great counter fighting as yeah, well from very, uh, yeah, display from the better Jane Knight. Great fight. Very good. This goes down to the judges' scorecards, and one of these extremely talented ladies will be WBC champion. Thank you. 